there is just over one year left until these images will take place again, but this time in Rio. That's why Brazil is already getting ready to host World Youth Day 2013. This official logo was chosen from 200 proposals that were submitted through an official competition. It comes in the shape of a heart with the famous statue of Christ the Redeemer. It was introduced in Rome by Cardinal Stanislaw Rilko, the chairman of the Pontifical Council for the Laity, otherwise known as the Vatican's frontman for the Vatican World Youth Days. It will be an icon for the World Youth Day in Rio de Janeiro, Christ with open arms. These arms are those of Christ, but also the Church with open arms, open to new generations. The Cardinal also said that part of the Stations of the Cross, which are prayed at every youth meeting, will go through the well-known slums of the city. And for the first time, after 26 years, World Youth Day returns to Latin America, which is home to 44 percent of the world's Catholics. The last World Youth Day held on that continent was in Argentina's Buenos Aires back in 1987. This time around, World Youth Day 2013 will take place in Rio from July 23rd to the 28th, and already about 2 million people are expected. On May 1st, experience the first anniversary of John Paul II's beatification with the unique celebration you won't forget. Be part of the first Rome Reports 2.0 event, a worldwide meeting online with images and stories of John Paul II. May 1st, 2012. Don't miss Rome Reports 2.0. Find out more on Facebook and Twitter.